and it will be applied to virtually everything that requires fuel to do or to make. Driving to work, heating your home, and even buying groceries in stores just like this. Everyday essentials will become more expensive this year thanks to the Trudeau carbon tax. And it couldn't come at a worse time for Canadian families. The cost of living is already on the rise and more and more Canadians are living on the knife's edge between making ends meet and falling behind. According to a recent survey, almost half of all Canadians, 48%, say they are within $200 a month from not being able to pay their bills. And 33% say they have no money left at the end of the month and are falling further and further into debt. A report last month from Dalhousie University and the University of Guelph said Canadian families will spend on average $411 more in 2019 on groceries than they did last year. And that's before factoring in Justin Trudeau's carbon tax, which will add even more to the grocery bill come April. So we know Justin Trudeau will raise the carbon tax even higher. His experts are telling him to, his own government departments are telling him to. And we know that he has already raised taxes. He's raised payroll taxes and, ta and cancelled tax credits. He's raised taxes on small businesses. And if not for Conservatives fighting back, he would have taxed employee benefits like health and dental coverage and free meals for waitresses and waiters. Canadians who are already anxious about their household budgets simply cannot afford this tax.